Author and broadcaster Giles Brandreth, who was a personal friend of Prince Philip, joined Clive Myrie on BBC One on Thursday to reflect on the Queen's reign. The former politician praised the Queen and noted how she is admired both in the UK and around the world. Giles said, It was extraordinary to think on Tuesday of this week this woman is sustained by faith and driven by duty was again doing her duty saying goodbye to her 14th Prime Minister and welcoming her 15th Prime Minister doing what she's been doing, for years. And thinking of our Prime Minister I think Liz Truss was born in 1975 and her first Prime Minister Winston Churchill, the only Prime Minister she called Winston, she called the others more formally, Winston was born in 1876. That gives you a feel of the span of her extraordinary life. But I think the reason that she is being mourned across the world, even by people who don't rate monarchy, don't think monarchy is important in the modern age is because of her quality as a person. He continued, she was undoubtedly our longest reigned sovereign, probably our most popular, certainly our most respected. Why? Because she had qualities that made her unique. Some kings and queens are remembered for the dramatic things that happened in their reign not so much this queen. The type of person she was, her dedication to service was so exemplary. Her courtesy, her kindness and her good humor never wavered, Giles noted. I was lucky enough to meet her when I was a teenager. Certainly she was the same person consistently throughout her life. What made her so special I don't know. She would thank God, she would say she had a blessed life and her faith is what kept her going. The Queen's eldest son King Charles III paid tribute to his beloved mother. His heartfelt statement read, The death of my beloved mother. Her Majesty the Queen, is a moment of the greatest sadness for me and all members of my family. We mourn profoundly the passing of a cherished sovereign and a much-loved mother. I know her loss will be deeply felt throughout the country, the realms and the Commonwealth, and by countless people around the world. During this period of mourning and change, my family and I will be comforted and sustained by our knowledge of the respect and deep affection in which the Queen was so widely held. Prime Minister Liz Truss stated, Queen Elizabeth II was the rock on which modern Britain was built. Our country has grown and flourished under her reign. Britain is the great country it is today because of her. Today the crown passes, as it has done for more than a thousand years, to our new monarch, our new head of state, His Majesty King Charles III. God save the king, 